I am Alexander Nana Kwekun Kesia Ejinyenku, a student of the University of Ghana where I currently read political science, philosophy and classics. I am passionate about literature, pop culture and classical studies and my skills include writing, content curation and public speaking. I want to become a Kufo scholar because I think that the experiences of the ones that have come before me in the previous scholarship programs is something that I'm likely to learn a lot from and I think that's going to help me with leadership along the way or in my future. One thing I want to be able to learn from the program is how to be able to handle project management or to enhance my project management skills in that if there's an action to be taken I'm able to do it effectively and in the best of my ability. I think this program is going to help me become more patient in working with other people and it's going to enhance my ability to see the world from different perspectives and how my leadership prowess is exactly going to combat those things or help those problems be solved. Thank you. A problem I identified with the community is that we have forgotten the relevance of the literary arts in community development and literacy. Literature is found in the hearts of men. It is the stories that we tell ourselves, that we embody, that we become. Literature is not a castle, ironclad, made of bone and marrow, unchanging. Why is literature so important in Ghanaian communities? The idea of a third place, which is not your home or not your workplace, but a third place where you are able to co-interact with people and develop bonds and friendships. That is where literature has thrived in Ghanaian communities. For example, many people met in these places to be able to tell stories at night time or to be able to tell themselves these things. Or these people were able to have plays or recitals which were communal events that have shaped communal narratives and inculcate a sense of belonging and develop a shared experience in the community. But also, how literacy is developed in this instance because of the fact that engagement with written text increases the retention of vocabulary and broadens the minds of readers, allowing them to understand the world from broader perspectives outside of their own. The problems that exist with literature in communities in Ghana is that there is not a lot of accessibility, firstly, but secondly, Ghana is losing its status as an important part of the great African story, and that local authors with unique perspectives are not prevalent enough, and that there's very little community infrastructure that allows for these arts to be portrayed. So if we are able to solve this problem, then we impact children in how they are inculcating their reading and writing and how like they pursue the fine arts to promote how they become well-rounded citizens. And we also help average individuals for them to relax in certain instances in these third phases that we talk about. That is something that is important. The way forward is introducing community programs in suburban and rural communities that provide avenues for these things, creating platforms for these quality pieces of contemporary Ghanaian literature to unfold and creating writing programs that feature stories from all over the country that capture the diversity of the Ghanaian experience. Thank you very much.